Hello, this is Mike Russell from MusicRadioCreative.com with an Adobe Audition quick tip. Take a look at my screen. I'm working in the multi-track on a session file right now with multiple different audio files. In fact, so many, I don't even know where they all are on my computer. This is fine for me working alone, solo, on this particular computer, but if I want to archive this session into the cloud or maybe save it and reopen it on another computer, there's going to be a problem when I try to reopen it. It won't find all the files unless I've saved them in exactly the same directory structure as they are on my current computer. So you can see the problem. There is a way around this. If you look at my directory here, VoiceOver, it's got the session file in but no audio files. Now there is a way to save this session with all the audio files contained. You go into the file menu of Adobe Audition, export, session, and you make sure save copies of associated files is ticked. You can go into options and you can convert the files into WAV or MP3, a different bit rate, whatever you fancy really, but the standard settings will work just fine. Click OK and it's going to save your multi-track along with the audio files associated with it. Look at that. Mike Voiceover underscore zero one is the name of the new multi-track session and if I click into this folder you'll see all the audio files associated with my session have also been saved. Now that my session file and the associated audio files are all in one place, I can archive it or copy it to a new computer and rest at ease. If you enjoyed this video, hit like and subscribe to my channel for more Adobe Audition quick tips.